When I remember his promises, I shout hallelujah. When I remember his promises, I shout hallelujah. Hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah, amen. Hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah, amen. When I remember his promises, I shout hallelujah. When I remember his promises, I shout hallelujah. Hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah, amen. Hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah, amen. Father, we bring our hallelujah to you. We give you our hallelujah. We thank you, Heavenly Father, for this bright new day. We bow before you. Thank you for your good and your mercies endures forever. Blessed be your name. Today we present ourselves to you. We declare that we are chosen by you. We are set apart by you. We are sanctified by you. We present our bodies as a living sacrifice. Please let our prayers today be holy and acceptable to you. We receive free passage for our prayers to ascend into the realms of the supernatural. Our prayers as from now will no longer be earthbound. In the name of Jesus, we confess our sins, we confess our faults, we confess our fumblings, we confess our feelings, we confess the sins of our fathers, our forefathers, Please have mercy upon us. We come into agreement with you in the name of the Lord Jesus. We disagree with the devil. We disagree with the world. We disagree with flesh. We come into agreement with you. Today we invoke the covenant of life. We say life shall answer to us in all ramification. We decree in line with your word that we are seated with Christ in the heavenly realms. And because we are there, the devil is made our footstool in the name of jesus we invoke the anointing of the spirit we break every yoke we open the heavens we release blessings we assign angels to reinforce us wherever we go today and wherever you send us today today by the anointing from above we advance to new realms we advance to new levels We advance to new dimensions. We advance to new territories. We take over the land of this world for you, Lord. In the name of Jesus, we tap into apostolic and prophetic anointing. We shatter every limitation. We cut the gate of brass. We shatter glass ceilings. We shatter realms and levels of darkness. We invoke the light of God. The Bible says the light shines in darkness and darkness cannot comprehend it. Lord, we announce your light that cannot be stopped or comprehended by the kingdom of darkness. We invade the region of principalities, the region of power, the region of rulers of darkness, the region where spiritual darkness and wickedness are entrenched with your incomprehensible light. In the name of Jesus, we take authority over demonic and satanic installations. We take authority over demonic and satanic plans. We take authority over demonic and satanic atmospheres and climates. In the name of Jesus, we render them powerless. We decree incantations are powerless in our lives cultic activities powerless in our lives curses powerless over us ill-spoken words powerless over us we are baptized with the holy ghost and with fire witchcraft activities powerless over us terrorism powerless over us fear powerless over our lives hatred Powerless in our homes, bitterness comes to an end. Unforgiveness comes to an end. 
in the name of Jesus, we feel the atmosphere and environment of our lives. We feel the atmosphere and environment of our homes with love. We feel it with peace. We feel it with agreement. We feel it with the glory of God. In the name of Jesus, the Bible says, righteousness, peace, and joy in the Holy Ghost. That is the kingdom of God. So we surrender our individual kingdoms to the kingdom of God. We surrender our wills to him. We decree, oh Lord, let your kingdom come in our lives, in our homes, in our environment, in our nation, and in our world today. Thank you, Heavenly Father. Blessed be your name. In Jesus' name, we pray. Amen, amen, and amen.